All right, I'm gonna make a quick video for everybody who is doing the Flat Curious project for me on Fiverr or whoever wants to take a big video and compress it down to a much, much smaller size without taking too much or much of a hit at all in quality. And it's by using a program called Handbrake. So you can download the program, go install it. It's not a big deal. When you pull up the program, this is what it's gonna look like. Just give it a second and what we'll see is a screen like this. You basically want to go to source and in here you pick uh, your video. It says open a single video file. Just choose a video. I'm just going to go to something in my Dropbox folder. Um, let's just go, I don't know, to one of my random commercials or something for a product. So let's do this backpack video. And this backpack video, let me see how big it was just now. All right, this is a 49 megabyte file. That's actually probably already cut down. Let me see if I can find one that's bigger. Uh, all right, this is 500 and 574 megabytes. So let's pick this one instead. All right, so it's scanning that title. It's got that source video name in there. This is the destination where it's gonna stick the uh, final video. And this is one thing that I have to do with mine. Now you can go to browse and you can pick where you want it. Let's just for time's sake, I'm going to stick it on the desktop right here and I'm going to rename it uh, compressed video. Okay. It's going to be named compressed video dot MP4. But look at this. It wants to stick M4V on the end here. This is something I've always had to fix and I don't know why. So just type dot MP4. So it's going to stick that last, that end file on my desktop as compressed video .mp4. Once you have it, you know, saying that, you can come over here to video tab and all this should stay the same, all right? Whatever mine says, make yours say that. I'm gonna go through each one of the tabs so you can pause the video and you can set your stuff to what mine says right now, okay? So pause the video at your leisure. None of the uh, subtitles or chapters matter, but video is an important tab. Over here in the quality, 20 is a good quality. The higher it goes, um, you get more quality video, but you can't really notice it past the 20, 22 mark here. Anything higher than that, you don't really notice it, but anything lower than 20, it starts really chopping that file size down. So with a 500 megabyte video, if I bump this down to like 30, and I hit start, it's gonna encode the video here. We're gonna take a look at the two different videos that it ends up making. All right, so let me pause the music that I have going on and let's take a look at the first video real quick. First video that I was uh, gonna do, let me find it again now. All right, so this is that 500 megabyte video. Let's hit play real quick. You can see the quality it's gonna show us. So that's the quality, I'm gonna blow it up. All right, 500 megabyte video. Pause it. You can see the outline of my hair. You know, all that. All that looks okay. Some some shininess on my nose. You can still see all that. Uh, this is a little blurry just because I'm I'm moving it, but you can read the words and everything just fine. Now this thing's about 40% of the way through. So go ahead and speed up the video if you're watching this after the fact, which everybody is because I recorded it. But um, I'll just sit here and talk while it's happening. But if you're listening to this part of the video, you're doing something wrong. <laughs> so it's 50%. I'm just going to let it do its thing. And that's really all the settings you need to do in the program. That's really it. Um, nothing special with the program. It's at 65%. Just going to wait till this is done. Go ahead and speed up the video. 5%. So we're going to see how, how small it made this. All right, here we go. Almost five more percent. All right, let's take a look at the desktop. 
So let's this. Oh, it's going to put it over there. Okay, that's fine. Here's the video. Hey, right, come on. And here it is. Compressed video, that MP4. Uh, you can just barely see some of the quality has been removed from the, both the words and some of my hair and just overall looks a little grainy. Just a little bit though. This is still a really good looking video. Let's see the file size. So it went from 550 to how much? 14. 14.7. That's the beauty of Handbrake when you're sending large files. So I just turned a 500 megabyte file into a 14 megabyte file with very, very minimal quality loss. So that's what you can do. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you learned something. Um, doodles.